Hey, what's up busy people? I wanted to pop out side really quick and reply to a question that I've been getting a lot, which is how do I cut my social media workload by 80% and then still get results or increase my results? And I have one client that was sort of the beginning of all of this and they legitimate, not, and it's not 80% for everybody, sometimes it's 50%, which is still amazing, but they legitimately cut their social media workload by 80% and just saw their revenue keep going up. And I want to share their story to kind of answer your questions as well as what you've been asking about my upcoming course, The 5-Minute Social Media Method, in this video so that your social media can reach its peak potential, okay? Let's talk about this. All right, I'm here at Gasworks Park in Seattle where I live. Uh, well, I live in Seattle, not here at the park. And I just wanted to tell you all about this uh, company that I work with where we cut their social media workload by 80%. And it's all of the principles that I developed in what I call the five minute social method. And the whole idea is to just narrow it down to the best parts of your social media marketing and get rid of the rest. So many of us have been listening to all these different experts and gurus for years and years and say, try this, try this, try this. And we put it all together and we go, why doesn't it work? Well, because for one, something that worked for somebody else doesn't necessarily work for you. And two, sometimes we end up trying two conflicting ideas that basically cancel each other out. And then three, we're just spending so much time on so many things that we don't get anything like all, we don't go all in on anything. So this, this was sort of the, the first client I work with, and I didn't call it this back then a few years ago, but what I now call the five minute social method, which I'm teaching in an advanced course coming up, but I also have a free training as well. And uh, I wanna share how to get on the early bird wait list for that in a second. But here's what happened. I went into this client and they were a chain of 10 retail locations across two states. And they were desperate. They had been posting on Facebook, LinkedIn, Instagram, Twitter, Tumblr. Uh, I think in the first meeting, somebody said, should we still have a MySpace page? And I was like, no, of course you shouldn't have it. You know, you don't need a MySpace page now for, you know, your type of business. And so what we did is we said, okay, what if we just focused on the things that worked? And so we looked at all those things and we just said, for now, let's just focus on Facebook, nothing else. Okay. The goal for the business, and this is the first step, is you gotta figure out your goals. They wanted top of mind awareness so that when somebody needed this business, they were the first you know, company they thought of. And then two, they had a very specific messaging that they wanted to get out there for their business. And this was important too. So we built the whole strategy around Facebook. They eliminated everything else. They started posting less. They started uh, focusing on the, just those two goals and nothing else. And within weeks, the amount of time they were spending on social media had gone down by 80%. Now it's not 80% for everybody, but even if you get your social media workload by 50%, that's pretty good for most of us, right? And here's what happened when they stopped doing so much work is their revenue started going up every single month. And I was elated. I'm like, I'm so glad this is working. I'm so glad we got to figure this out. And uh, <laughs> the funny thing is it started that way and then they said, no, no, this is even better than you think because the rest of our industry is trending down. Everybody else's business is down and ours is still going up. So that was the beginning of my five minute social method. It was built at an agency, then perfected across hundreds of small businesses. I've only ever offered it to one-on-one -on -one clients for the most part. And now I'm putting it in a course. I finally figured out the time to put it into a course. And so if you're interested in the free six part training, or if you want to get uh, first access to the course when it launches here very soon, go to five minute social method.com. You can uh, also find the link in the description of this video. And uh, here's what happens. The reason I created the early bird waitlist is because I can only work with a small handful of students in this course. I want people to get results. I'm not interested in getting, you know, a bunch of people into watch information and then not do anything with it. If this comes with a ton of support, me working with you, uh, live Q and A's, all of that kind of thing. And so I want to make sure the people who really want to get in are the ones that do get in. So if you think that might be you, join the early bird wait list and you'll get access to enroll a full day before the general public uh, to make sure that you get a spot, okay? Get your name on there and let me know if you have any questions. And uh, once you're signed up, we'll send you more information about the free six part training and how to make sure you get a spot in the five minute social media method very, very soon.